today we are kicking off the Spear of Arkansas Diaper Drive, sponsored by Edwards Food Giant and Edwards Cash Saver. Joining me today, Steve Edwards Jr., of course, with the Special Projects Manager at Edwards Food Giant, and Ms. Allison Gatton, who is a Central Arkansas Diaper Bank board member. Allison, kick us off and just explain the Central Arkansas Diaper Bank. How did this begin and why did it begin? So the Central Arkansas Diaper Bank is a free community resource where we give out free diapers to families in need every month. So last year, we distributed over 157,000 diapers to over 530 kids. Um, you know, we're really alleviating a huge burden for families. You know, some of these families may be walking through Edwards and going, do I feed my child or do I give them diapers? One in three families are making that that hard decision because one in three families are struggling to have diapers. So in 2018, we, we did a diaper drive at uh, Plasky Heights United Methodist Church and we gave diapers to a daycare. And um, after doing that, we realized that there was a greater need and that the community really needed a, an actual uh, service to the entire community, not just one insulated group. So um, that's when we launched the full-blown Central Arkansas Diaper Bank. And uh, we've been around since that drive for five years now. So five years this month, it's very exciting. It is, and like you said, an incredible need and a great resource for the community. Steve, why did Edwards want to get involved with this? Well, we always want to be good stewards to the community, and whenever we were approached about becoming a partner in 2020, diapers were really hard to come by, and I was kind of wondering, you know, is this really going to work? And we raised 35,000 diapers that first year, did 55 this past year, and so we're excited to hopefully break that record again this year. Yes, we are going to break We will 55,000. <laughs> diapers yeah. for sure that's happening um, y'all are parents so you know the importance of diapers I'm expecting myself so I will get to learn the importance of diapers but Steve go on into detail of, of, of helping those in need that really need this I mean it's so helpful to the community exactly you know like you were saying you know some parents are having to choose between feeding their child or diapers and uh, I know one of the big talking points early on was a lot of these kids can't even get into a daycare if they don't have an adequate supply of diapers so it's just really a good way of ensuring that these kids not only stay healthy but they're able to keep into that normal routine of going to daycare going to school and allow their parents to continue making a living and, and carrying on with life as normal okay so for the next several weeks we are going to be collecting these diapers allison give the community a, a way to drop off these diapers how can they do that so at all edward food giants and edward cash savers in central arkansas there's 13 stores? Yes. Yes. 13 stores. Um, you can drop them in the bins located up in the front of the stores. You can also come to Plasky Heights United Methodist Church. We'll have bins as well where you can drop them off. And then we also have some families that just send us an order through Amazon. So anything that we collect over the month of, of September, um, August 21st, first through the end of September, we will count towards the drive. So we're keeping those separate when they, we get them at the church, do it through Amazon, Target, whatever it may be, um, get those to the church and we'll count them in our, in our total doesn't matter what kind of brand of diapers no I'll also say so obviously like come buy diapers um, you know these packs that like what uh, Steve has in his hands we take those we also take open packs so if your child grows out of a pack um, we'll take those because what we do is we have to open up this pack and then put it into our own packaging so okay. we have a whole volunteer team that unpack that repack it and put it in the actual quantities that we provide to families so if you grew out of them bring them to us don't put them in the trash we'll take them um, so you can drop those off at, at Edwards Food Giant, put those in there, and they'll get to us, and we'll get them all packaged up. What about sizes? Is one more important than the other? Absolutely. Everybody thinks diapers babies. Um, but, you know, what a lot of our families are coming to us for are the larger sizes. So the number that we're actually giving out, I don't know why that is, but the number that we're giving out the most is the the larger, like, five and six of diapers, and then all of the, um, the pull-up sizes. That's where we're notoriously having storage issues, and so I just don't have an influx of that number. And so I'm constantly having to buy those every month. So please those bigger sizes those are the ones that we really need for our families i have so many newborn in size one so um those bigger sizes are really helpful pull-ups just really great and i don't care what they look like if it has elsa on it i'll give it to a kid <laughs> yeah it really doesn't yeah, matter it doesn't does. matter <laughs> all right steve any last words before we we kick this off today that you want to say on behalf of edwards food giant we're just excited to be a part of it again and uh, i'm going to kick us off with a good donation my child is growing like a weed so i've got a box full of diapers that he has outgrown that have been building up in our garage over the past
past few months that I'm ready to dump in this bin and get out of my house. <laughs> <laughs> and another large donation to kick us off. Who's donating that? That's correct. Kimberly Clark is going to do a pretty big donation to help get us kicked off. So hopefully we will have a pretty good baseline to get this thing kicked off and, uh, and shatter that 55,000 record that we hit last year. Perfect. So again, we're going to exceed that goal starting today at the 21st through the month of September. Drop off locations, Edward Food Giant or Edwards Cash Come Saver. I love it. Thank you both so much for joining Thank me today. You. And we'll have more Channel 7 News after the break. Hi, everyone. Chris May here. Thanks for checking out the KATV YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click the subscribe button. And don't forget to download the KATV News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.